Hey guys, what's up? Nikhil here from Dope Motions and welcome to a brand new tutorial. Today I'll be showing you a cool text effect, actually a title which I created for a rap music video named Speed Bada Day and I'll just show you what it is and how it looks like. Yep, so it looks cool and advanced. So let's just hop into After Effects and let's get started. So first of all, create a new composition and then what I'm going to do is, I'm going to create a new solid, I'll name it stroke cause first we're going to be creating that strokes and lines. Okay, and then I should tell you guys before only you will need a third party plugin for this effect called particular which is easily available you can download it right there trap cut particular you can see right there yep so this you'll need this to create the effect then right click go to new create a light and name it emitter and it is very important to name it like this cause if you don't name it emitter it won't apply in the particular plugin so very important to name it like that then I'll create a new null object and hit P on the keyboard to bring up the position properties I'll just go right there out of the frame a little more bit than zero and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hit on the position stopwatch and Oh, it should be on zero right there, or I'll start from right there. I'll just drag a little to about let's see, I'll keep it to right about four frames. And then what I'm gonna do is I'll go to right about 25 frames and then change its position to right about there out of the frame. Yep, so now we have this thing. And then what I'm going to do is, I'm going to parent this light to this null. Now you can see the light is a little forward, so what I'm going to do is, I'm going to hit P and change this position properties, all the pro position properties to 0. So now the light is properly parented to it. And now what I'm going to do is, go to particular, go to emitter and select lights. So now you can see the emitter is connected to the lights and the null object. So now all the work starts right now. So first of all, I'll change the velocity to zero, all these things to zero, zero, change this to zero, zero, and zero. Yep, so now we have a line right there. And then increase the, I'll go to partic particular and increase the size a little bit right there and I'll go to emitter and I'll go to life and I can increase this life also if you want you can keep it right there and then then I'm gonna increase this the particle sec from 100 to let's make this I'll keep it 4000 will be enough yep so we get these lines and I'll see now after that what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to here to about here. streaks oh where are the streaks huh first of all I'll change this particular from spear to streaklet and then I'm gonna go to the streaklet and I'll change the size to about three Yep, oh it looks some um, more very little so I'll change this to button 20, I'll keep it 20, yep 20 looks good. And then what I'm gonna do is, I'll just increase the streaklet, oh my god, the streaklet size to about right there and decrease the streak size right there from 20 to LC, let's make it, yep this looks cool and you can you know you can play with it or adjust it till you get the satisfied result I'll keep it right there I'll just increase the seeds to see what 
I like yep I like this and then what I'm gonna do is I'll go to world transform and position the way you want I'll position it to the center yep so it looks cool so now we have this animation right there but it still looks uh pretty lame you can see so what I'm gonna do is I'll go to particular right there and change the life second to about 0 0.6 you can give it whatever you want or as per your need so that it ends right there you can see right there yep so now you can see that the particles end right there but a spot remains you know you can see it right there so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to the null hit YouTube Bring up the keyframes, go to the last keyframe right there and bring it more out of the frame. So now you can see we have done it. Yep, so now no spots in the line. Yep, so go on the stroke and then what I'm gonna do is I'll just close this emitter in particular so you can see properly what I'm doing here. I'll go to shading and turn this shading on so we get this thing. It looks more cool than before now see right there yep and then I'm gonna go to let's see I'm gonna color it so I'll change adbird to over life now we get this cool color now you can go to color life and select this various scheme right there now there are tons of cool thing you can do with it I'll change this white color to let's see I'll make it a I'll make it blue and yep looks cool already now you can see we have this light thing right there so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to now by changing the parameter diffuse right there you can get the result whatever you want to the time you get satisfied so I'll, I'll keep it right there looks cool Yep, looks pretty good right there. So I'll just pretty quick show you guys what we have made it. You can see right there, looks so cool right there. Yep, so now what we're gonna do is I'll just select this keyframe and hit F9 to easy ease it. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna duplicate the strokes and I'm gonna change the size to right about one and change the world transform to I'll change y offset to right about there you can see yep and then I'll change randomize the seeds in different ways so it looks a little bit different and then I'm gonna change this color I'll make it a red this time yep so it looks cool you can see it looks so pretty cool and then half of it through so the main and the important part is over right now if you have learned something new till now just go ahead and hit like or subscribe so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add a text right there I'll just add a text pretty quick I'll name it speed right this and I'll just increase the size right there now this font doesn't look pretty nice you know so I'll just change a cool a keep of cool font which indicate a little bit of speed right there I'll just see yep this looks cool actually this is the actual font which I used in my video which I sh showed you the preview of and I'll just change the color now it doesn't matter which color you keep cause we are gonna add a texture to it so for adding a texture I'll pretty quick go into my After Effects folder and see what type of texture I've got in where's the texture texture yep yeah I'll go to this texture and I'll just I'll just let's see what I I'll just select this now you can take your time and select properly whichever you want and put it below the speed and then what I'm gonna do is change this track mat to alpha matte and then you get this cool texture effect right there looks so cool and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna position it 
with the null so you go to right here hit on the position properties I'll go to about right there bring this position right to about zero oops sorry yep and out of the frame right there then go to right about where the lines are in the center and I'll place it in the center pretty quick yep so now we have this animation oh my god I forgot to keyframe it I'm sorry for that guys I'll just go right about there here on the stopwatch go back zero and I'll just bring it down right there so now what we have is we get this cool animation now it looks a little lame you can take your time and adjust it a little proper I'm doing a little fast so that the tutorial won't be more lengthy now it looks a pretty lame so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add this motion blur the, which will make it look more cooler you can see in the preview uh, in the preview I have added some smoke and stuff and optical flares you know which makes the text look more cooler now you can go anytime with the texture and you can go to texture and add some effects or make some color correction right there I'll show you guys pretty quickly I'll add a curves effect to the texture and then you can increase this curves or something the blue and just increase the blue thing right there you can see we get this cool texture right in go to about green and then increase increase till I get my result as I get satisfied yep so looks cool you can see we get this cool text right here speed text which you can use it in your videos to make a cool titles you see looks so cool you know so I hope you guys learned something new today and thanks for watching guys